Hi Gemini, it's Ellie. Welcome to my channel and we are doing your reading. So the person on your mind, what are their current feelings for you? We're going to find out. Let's begin. This reading is good for your sun, moon, rising, and Venus signs. If this reading resonates for you, please give this video a thumbs up. And I would love it if you subscribe to my channel. I'm grateful to each and every one who has. I'm, I am grateful to each and every one of you who has been subscribed and supporting me here on YouTube. And as my way of saying thank you, I will be giving away one free personal reading at the end of the month. Um... I will be giving away one free reading at the end of the month. I kind of blanked out there. I'm going to announce the mechanics of this reading on how to join the raffle um, in my weekly love readings, which will be uploaded on the weekend. All right, so stay tuned and I hope you win. Gemini, your overall energy, your person's overall energy is the Empress. You could simply be dealing with a, a Libra, but, or they could have Libra placements. Um, the Ten of Cups, the Moon, the Magician, the Wheel of Fortune, the Five of Swords, the Strength card, and then the Two of Cups. My, my. I love it. I love it. Okay. Gemini, your person's current challenge for this month is the sun. So I'm getting... There, it, there was some sort of clarity that came towards them. Things have been very clear. This might not, may not resonate for every one of you, but I'm getting here that whatever it is that your person has been, you know, has been deciding regarding your relationship in the last few months, I'm getting 10 to, two, 10 to 19 months. It was all driven by family dynamic. Very much a family dynamic. So it's very clear to them. Very clear to them. I'm getting this person. I'm sorry if I if I if I say this, I might rub you the wrong way, but I'm getting that your person has had does have ab abandonment issues, especially regarding family abandonment issues. This person could have had a rough childhood and they have come to a point where they grew up pleasing their family, their parents, or whoever, you know, person in charge was who was, you know, standing as a family uh, or as a parent. But I'm getting that they grew up that way. They grew up the way where they had to please their way to get the affection of their parents. So now it's very clear to them that everything, almost everything in their life, it's clear to them now that it was driven by family and not by themselves. In short, they didn't have a choice when they were younger or you know in the last few until the last few months they did they realized they feel that they did not have a choice that took me a while i'm sorry <laughs> okay so you your person's overall energy for this month main energy is the empress yes your person is realizing their self-worth realizing very much your self-worth and realizing that you are the empress you are their empress Male, female, not really gender specific. We are looking at the energy. I'm getting your person is actually seeing that you were worth the fight. 
You are their empress. You are the queen of all queens. No one can ever compare to you, Gemini. No one can ever compare to you. And I'm getting you're the only, you're one of the first people, or not, not, not just first, but probably the first person to really see this person's worth. Your person has the Ten of Cups to the Wheel of Fortune. Very much strong family dynamic here. This person might be wanting to get approval from their parents regarding this relationship that they want with you. I'm getting for some reason that For some reason, I'm getting that the family really, it's going to be hard to get the approval of the family. It might only resonate for some, but it might get to a point where the family... would cut this person out of their life out of the will out of the fortune that they're supposed to get but take it how it resonates but what i'm getting here is the family really disapproves as of now energies can change all right energies can change you have the moon to the five of swords I'm getting a very heavy energy. This person has, hasn't been telling you the truth about how the family has been, you know, the family's perspective about this relationship. Their opinion about this relationship. I'm sorry about my dog. Um, this person hasn't really been telling you the truth. I'm getting very selfish energy. Very selfish energy. Could be dealing... They did not want to expose you. They're, they're hiding this because they don't want to expose you, your precious heart, to a very selfish energy. But this person is really manifesting that you finally come into union. This person is taking a lot of, you know, it's taking a lot in them. They're taking courage and really wanting to fight this relationship for you to be together in the end. Right. What is the overall outcome of this reading? Oh. The overall outcome of this reading, Gemini, is the Two of Pentacles, the Lovers, and then the five of pentacles so i'm getting your person is needs to make a choice i'm getting their hand is getting twisted is it the hand or the arm that you twist anyway they're backed in a corner backed up against the wall i'm guessing I'm getting 
they are being made to choose between you, your deep soul connection, or being isolated from the family. What is the advice for What is the advice for my Gemini's? Okay. Gemini, the advice of spirit for you is the page of pentacles, the death card, the devil, and then the Seven of Pentacles. Spirit is telling me, I'm sorry, it, it took it took a long pause. Spirit is telling me whether you should assess this relationship. That you should assess this relationship. Whether or not it's worth the time. If the offer that your person is giving you is adequate enough. Or you're just very stuck with this person. You feel obsessed. Please don't shoot the messenger when I say it, all right? There is some sort of obsession here. Um, Codependency code between the two of you. Maybe you label it as love, but it's a very toxic kind of love. Codependency is a very toxic kind of love. You have to assess and then understand and then decide whether or not you want to end this relationship. All right. Okay. Other messages from your person for your person, potential adventures and then truth. I'm getting the the truth would eventually find um come out. There are a lot of adventures that they want to take on with you. And your relationship is actually just a great big adventure and potential. Your person is hoping that, your, that their family sees the potential in this relationship. Okay? So that is all I have for you, Cancer. I, I'm sorry, Gemini. You might have a Cancerian placement. But that is all I have for you, Gemini. I hope something in this reading resonated. If it did, please give this video a thumbs up. I will see you in the next reading. I love you all and stay blessed.